welcome to a quick demo of Kodi Media Player. As you can see, I've got Kodi in the background, and in the foreground I've got an X panel running Kodi Media Player. Of course, you can install the Kodi Media Player on any Core 3 touch panel or the Crest Run app. Today I'll demonstrate selecting and playing a movie, browsing TV shows, going through your music collection, and slideshows. First, let's look at movies. Press the movie button. The disc turns while information is being loaded from Kodi. You can see the posters coming in. Drag the slider or flick on an iPhone to go down the whole list. It's an endlessly scrolling list, regardless of how many movies there are. The list is sortable by these four categories. You can also find individual items in the list by clicking the magnifying glass and typing in what you're looking for. Here if I were searching for the movie Inception, I would type it in and Inception shows at the top. Clicking it will start the movie. As you can see after the movie starts, the metadata on the left hand side updates got the movie title, the poster. Below that you have some volume controls including mute, demonstrating the mute button here, unmuting, volume down, volume up, hold it down to move quicker, the time moves on the slider, and you can pause the movie. Or unpause it, by pressing the play button. You can fast forward through it by pressing the forward button. The speed with which it's forwarding appears just above the play button. Press play to stop it forwarding. Further control over the, over the player can be obtained using the remote control button, which is the plus. You can tab through the subtitle streams tab through the audio streams, press the stop button to stop, and the plus button to hide the remote control. Let's return now to the home menu by pressing the home menu. Press the TV shows button to start browsing your TV shows, drag the slider as before. Select the show that you're interested in. The seasons come up. Select each season and the list of episodes appears. Drag down to see which episodes or press play all to play them all. Clicking on one will start the episode. The now playing metadata shows immediately. Let's press stop. Stop the TV show playing and the home button to get back to the main list. Now let's have a look at music. Pressing the music button gives you three choices. Artists, albums and genres. The artists will give you an entire list of your artists. Dragging down shows all of the artists that you have on your music collection. Clicking one lists their albums. Clicking the album lists the songs within that album. Pressing this button will play all of the songs or select one that you want to see. Okay, let's go back out of that and we'll go to the albums list. It'll show you all of the albums with the album art that you have in your collection. You can drag down, select an album, press the play all button, see the metadata come in. I'm now pausing it. Pausing it and going back out to look at the genre menu. These are the albums I have under jazz as a genre. Back out again to the home menu and we'll take a look at starting a picture slideshow. Select your source. These are a list of folders available in your source. 
select a folder. Going back out, selecting another folder. Press the play all button. And the slideshow will start while your music continues. Going to the remote control and pressing the info button shows the info appearing on code. Pressing stop twice will stop all slideshows and audio playing. Let's go back out to the home menu and take a look at an advanced feature. If you press the advanced options button in the home menu, you can select unwatched only. That means when you browse a list of your movies or your TV shows, it'll only show those movies that you haven't seen yet. You can see at the top of the menu it says I have 379 unwatched movies. To exit the unwatched function, just return to the home menu, press the advanced button, and select display all. That's the end of the short demonstration of just some of the things that the Kodi Media Player can do. Uh, if you want more information, please check out my website at www.shandonsoft.co.uk. There's a link in the comments page. Thanks for watching. Bye.